Okay, what's up guys? Welcome back. So, it's been a while. Um, sorry it's kind of late. Um, like, I don't know. I've been busy playing. Uh, just playing around. Um, since school started back and everything, I've been a little busy and I don't get to play um, as much. So, I've really been spending most of my time playing uh, Dota with uh, Ryan and Mackenzie and just screwing around because, I don't know, since I don't have as much time during the day after school's over with, I, uh, I try to spend it doing as much as I can, like having fun. Um, not that this isn't fun, it's just that... Um, I don't know. It's not like top priority for me most of the time, which I don't know. You kind of have to understand that I don't really like to record Minecraft all the time, and so when I'm in the mood for it, most of the time they're wanting to play anyway and everything, so I end up getting off track, but it's cool. So today I figure we could make a couple village houses um, so that way I can start getting some villagers um, up and or send them up through this um, and try to get them out in here and you know get them to interact with everything so hopefully that'll be working uh, soon whenever I take the time to actually get zombie villagers um, I'm really running low on oak wood though so I'm just kinda as you can see I've got like tons of saplings around here um, whoa, what happened here oh I know what this I know what I did wrong okay that's not a corner. All right. I've also noticed that. I've, or well, anyways, uh, let me start in a different area. Um, me and Slash uh, have been playing on a server that he bought. So um, I've been kind of getting both of these worlds confused because I logged on to here. And I was like, all oh, right. And then I noticed that <laughs> all of my enchantments totally suck because um, I've been playing on there for a couple. Like it's been about two to three weeks of playing on there. So I don't know. It's been pretty fun though. It's just something to do in my spare time with him at least. Because since he doesn't do YouTube or anything as much anymore, like he actually doesn't do anything on there pretty much. Um, I don't know. I, we don't get to play games and record them, so I've been just trying to do whatever I can. Um, and he wanted to play uh, Minecraft Survival on 1.6 at least because he had never played like all the way through since the newer updates come out, um, and we w we've been all the way through it and beat the Ender Dragon. And somebody sent me a message on Skype. Um, but, yeah, so, another message on Skype, <sighs> anyways, I'm going to come back once I have more oak wood and everything, just wanted to kind of start the episode and everything, so I will be right back. tons and tons of wood now um, and these trees are actually growing now so I'm gonna have to cut these down too but yes went got some glass by the way um, so yeah I'm having fun playing Minecraft lately like um, I got a new monitor um, don't know if I've said that in any of my previous videos yet um, but I've had it for like 
couple weeks now. Um, and I don't know, I'm having trouble getting used to it because my computer is really getting outdated and I'm getting to the point where I kind of need a new one. Um, like, I had a $300 budget for my current computer, so it it's a little under, under, um, I don't know how to say it, underfunded, I'll say it like that. Um, it was great when I first got it, because it was definitely a huge upgrade from what I had. Um, my old computer couldn't even play Minecraft, barely on tiny settings, so, yeah, pretty terrible. Um, dang it, I'm gonna have to go to sleep as soon as I freaking started. Um, but, it was definitely a huge upgrade from my old one, um, and, uh, me and my brother actually helped, or, my brother helped me put together this, uh, the one I'm using right now and it's a good computer I won't I'm not gonna say it's terrible um, it's like a, it's the dual core um, with four gigs of RAM and a Radeon HD 5450 graphics card which is pretty good because um, back when I built it, I was looking at the specs of like other people's computers that I watched on YouTube and stuff, and they had like really, really good specs on their computers and everything, and I was just like, wow, it would be awesome to get as close as I can to that. Which, I mean, that isn't terrible, um, because obviously they had good computers that ran what they needed to, so if I was trying to base it off of theirs, I wouldn't really be that far. Um, from a great computer, but with a $300 budget, um, obviously I'm not going to get everything that I would have wanted, um, which, my computer's great, I like it, um, but it is getting time for an upgrade, so hopefully sometime uh, after Thanksgiving, I think the Cyber Monday things, uh, happening which if you don't know what that is it's when um, it's like once a year it's like right after Black Friday um, it's called Cyber Monday and you can most uh, websites that sell like anything they'll do all of their like online deals and stuff on then or like on that day so I'll probably see if I can get something from Newegg uh, and try to see if uh, we have the money for it and I will try and see if we can get a new computer at some point which would be awesome because I've gotten to the point with this computer to where it's it's not bad but I'm not getting everything that I can out of it like I can't play a lot of the newer games that are coming out because the all the stuff on them is a little bit better than what mine was built for um, so hopefully I can get something good um, just depends on what my budget is then um, and we will see so uh, like I I got a lot of the new humble bundles because uh, I've been looking into that a lot lately mainly because you get great games for cheap um, and I don't always have the money to be spending like sixty dollars on a game so with the humble bundles uh, normally they have really awesome games that they're actually giving away for really like low amounts of money um, like uh, the, the newest one that I've gotten so far is um, it's the new Humble Indie Bundle 9 and it's awesome in my opinion because um, I'm really into indie games uh, lately so it's actually nothing or not a terrible deal for me I mean most people uh, don't really like indie games that much which I can kinda understand that because most indie games aren't um, 
they're not like fully developed and half of them you get in beta so they're still like working out bugs and stuff whereas like if you get like um the newest call of duty or something they're obviously going to be um more funded and they're not going to be as many bugs and it's just like a full game right there whereas like with minecraft per se um it would be um where you would get it uh, say an alpha there would be a lot of updates in between um, and then eventually you get to the point to where like they've added lots and lots of features and stuff like that so yes um, but yeah I've been buying those a lot lately uh, to see if I can get anything good I mean which most of the game or most of the deals that they have on there are really awesome um, so I'm really happy with most of them. Uh, the newest indie game bundle is out right now, um, but you know that could be way earlier from when some people might watch. Um, so I got like a ton of good games, um, and I actually got Limbo, which is uh, one of the first games that I ended up playing on my channel and um and I'm thinking about maybe doing another doing another go of that because I think it would be cool to um go back and play a game that I actually f like first played on my channel um like I played it on my first computer and I'm really surprised at that because the game is I don't know it's a game and my old computer was not anything to be playing games on honestly um but I don't know just I've been trying to get stuff and just mess around with it and yeah I just I don't know nothing really big's happening lately um, I'm actually moving soon um, and I don't know what it is lately but like uh, I watch people on YouTube and obviously whoever watches this is watching me on YouTube and it's funny because I watch a lot of people and they're like, oh yeah, move in, and here's my new apartment video, and all this stuff. And I just, I'm like, why do these people move so much? Um, which I'm not moving for like a reason that they would be moving, um, which that would happen eventually because I'm still living with my parents, obviously, because I'm still in school. Um, but I don't know, it's just funny because like everybody was moving at like one point in time uh, when I was watching people and uh, now I'm actually moving so um, hopefully uh, everything goes okay with that at least um, I don't really expect anything to really go wrong I'm upgrading to a newer house which is great um, uh, and it's actually a house, whereas right now I live in like a smaller kind of trailer thing. Um, but yeah, that's just North Carolina for you. Um, I don't really know what kind of design I'm going for with this. So I think this is one of the designs that I've done pretty much with uh, all of my villager buildings on me and Alex's server. Um, and. I kind of like it actually like it's it's kind of spacious and it looks good on the outside it is a little bit taller than I would want but that's it's fine um, hmm. I think it'll get the job done there alright even though this video might not be as packed with enjoyment as most of them, I don't know, I just like to get on here and talk sometimes. Which, hopefully you guys can understand that. Um, I don't know, that's really one of the reasons why I do this, is to talk to you people. Um, sounded really weird when I said that. You people. Makes it sound like, like a racist scenario, honestly. Um, 
this is about it for this one I'm probably since we're already at like 15 minutes and all I've really done is just talk to you guys which hopefully you don't mind but um, I'll probably cut away and then try to put in some other houses throughout here I just want to kind of show you guys the um, the basic design for what all of these houses are going to be um, they'll probably be all the same um, but I might end up doing a little bit to some of them like just some added features to some of them and then um, I'll come back and then I'll show you guys what I've done so yeah I'll finish finish up this one and then I'll get a couple other ones up and maybe put in some roads and stuff so that way I don't feel like I totally wasted a whole episode building one whole house and yeah um, oh one other thing really quick before I um, cut off and try to build a whole bunch of buildings um, I am currently on Minecraft 1.64 which you can see up there in the top top left um, and I've already went to my nether fortress to try to make sure nothing get, goes wrong with that um, and basically with 164 it makes it to where you're it's like a prep stage for uh, the new update uh, whenever 1.7 comes out so because there's a lot of like terrain generation stuff going on and they're they're having to make sure that nobody loses their like witch huts and nether fortresses and stuff so I've already went to my nether fortress so everything should be good with it and uh, yeah so let's take a look at the outside really quick just to show you guys what we're dealing with I really like the fact that it comes out in a different like it like indents in a little bit so that way there's like two different roofs I really like that for some reason in most of my new builds so that's about it um, and I will come back once I have a couple more done so yeah be right back So, really quick, um, I have 44 levels after, um, well, technically, uh, not after a certain amount of time. Well, yeah, it was a certain amount of time, but what happened was I wanted to do an enchantment on my shovel, and I already kind of skipped through a little bit of that. Um, so, that's what I got on it. Efficiency 4, not that great. Um, I figured I'd do this one on camera, but I had 500 zombies in here. Um, what I did was I had, or I came up in here because I was hungry and I wanted to go get some lunch really quick before I messed around and did the rest of my episode. So I blocked this off, um, and then I accidentally went in there and I guess, or well, I went and got something to eat first of all, and then I laid down on the couch and fell asleep watching the movie on TV, and I was asleep for about an hour, um, so... I don't know. This thing put out 500 in about an hour, which is, I don't know, I guess that's pretty good. I got 44 levels off of it. So, hooray. So let's see what we get on this axe. Um, I've been getting really crappy enchantments lately, so I'm just going to mix it up a little bit and then click one. And I get awesome, exactly what I would have wanted for an axe. Everything else I get crappy enchantments on, but an axe seems like it's my best bet right now so either way I'm gonna finish up the rest of my houses really quick and then I'll be right back to end off the episode so yeah be right back alright so hopefully I've done enough for now at least I'll probably do a little bit more off camera but I wanna go ahead and end this episode off so this is what we're dealing with here so here's the original one that we started with and I've got the paths uh, going all the way over here whereas originally it was just a path going all the way over to my little shack thing here um, I got a smaller one I actually lowered it down one block so that way it's I don't know it seems smaller that one seems more like a church now because these other two are kinda small and I don't know they're more of a villager house but that one looks more like a church to me now just cause it's raised up a little bit more um, but yeah, I got roads going over here and over there. And uh, actually, I've been getting enough dirt to really fill in some of this area here. So I've got to fill in this one and that one. 
and then I'm going to leave a little pond area here, and it'll be cool. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, also, one other thing that I wanted to do um, is over here, I'm wanting, instead of putting this little dock here, I'm going to put like a little seaside shack thing, so that way I can fish off of in the next update, um, which will probably be one of the first things we do. Um, so look forward to me trying to enchant a fishing rod, uh, hopefully. Uh, maybe next episode, actually, because I might end up upgrading to the snapshot since this is 1.64 and I've already got everything situated. So, yeah, I'll see you guys then, and bye!